I just wanted to show you how to save an impose template and then uh, be able to back those up. So if you go to a job and go to the impose option, it will open up your impose. If you go to edit and preferences, this will show you your path under impose. Here is your uh, imposition path and your templates for impose. So you can go and uh, copy and paste this path here. Um, and then if you want, you can go to your run command and open this up. This will open up that location. And as you can see, I did one test impose uh, template so that you can see where it's located. So then you just copy and paste this folder and um, to a safe place, maybe a server location that's getting backed up every day. Uh, but a great way to uh, be able to back up your imposition templates once you set them up. So I also want to show you how to um, go in and save your output profiles or input profiles or ICC profiles. So if you double click on this bar here, it's the same as going into device manager. You go down to your profiles and for example, say you had some profiles, maybe one that's called less magenta, uh, you would go and export it. If you'll notice, you can also select a bunch, export it, and save these also to a new file. So that's a great way to back up your output profiles. And lastly, there is another um, another thing if you want to save and back up your job presets. So presets and templates are two different things. Um, your job presets, just some quick things that you want to set up in your jobs. That's where these would be. And again, you can see you can export those as well. So that's a quick tutorial on how to export templates, job presets, and profiles. If you do have any saved custom um, spot colors or groups, substitute groups or spot color groups, you can export those as well here.